What's up guys? So, I'm gonna start off this video by just being 100% honest with you guys. I have literally never played Mass Effect. I know, I know, it's embarrassing, alright? But, it's okay though, because we have the Legendary Edition right here, and I plan to go through the entire series, maybe not one right after another, but I am gonna play them sequentially. Just not right after another, obviously. Then that my channel will get flooded with Mass Effect. But who knows? Maybe this game is so amazing that I might play it. I don't know. You know what? I'm just going to stop rambling. I'm super, super hyped for this game. I have never played Mass Effect. But ever since they announced Mass Effect Legendary, I literally was hyped. Because I hear nothing but good things about this game from everything so i know a little bit about the game nothing about the story but i know about shepherd obviously i know about the ship normandy uh the only reason i remember that is because of world war ii uh and stuff like that so it just kind of stuck in my head uh other than that i don't know much about this game literally nothing so i'm pretty hyped to go in this 100 blind if you're excited to watch this let's play though do me a huge favor drop a like on this video also subscribe to the channel if you're not already subscribed because it really does help this channel grow guys so with that being said let's just stop yapping and jump right into this Classified top secret, you say? So far, it looks great. Granted, it's only the intro, but still. So I have John Shepard, Jane Shepard. Okay, so... New ID? Is that like a character creator? I'm just gonna go with John Shepard. Uh, not for any real reason, just beside, just because I'm a guy, obviously, and I feel like playing as a dude, so that's generally how I like to play, so that's how I'm going to choose it for this game. So I'm gonna go with John Shepard. That gun looks pretty sick, it kind of reminds me of Halo for some reason though. Alright, let's go ahead and just click for John. You know what? I'm going, I'm gonna be extreme here. And bam, I am Amerigamer Shepherd. <laughs> All right, let's go. Ahead. Let's do this. Uh, name Amerigamer Shepherd. Origin Earthborn. Reputation Soul Survivor. When did I become a Vault Dweller? Okay, I'll take it. Class Soldier. Love it. Just like real life. I miss my time in the army, by the way. Well, what about Shepard? Earthborn, but no record of his family. Doesn't have one. He was raised on the streets, learned to look out for himself. He saw they his whole unit die on a cruise. He could have some serious emotional scars. His voice sounds familiar. Every soldier has that scars. guy. Shepard's a survivor. Is that the kind of person we want protecting the galaxy? Absolutely. That's the only kind of person who can protect the galaxy. I'll make the call. Let me see if I can, uh... Okay. In the year 2041, explorers on Mars discovered the remains of an ancient space-faring civilization. In the decades that followed, these mysterious artifacts revealed the startling new technologies enabling travel to the furthest stars. The basis of uh, for this incredible technology was a force that controlled the very fabric of space and time. They called it the greatest discovery in human history. Civil ah, just a little bit too fast. Mass Effect. That looks great, by the way. The second I get a chance, I'm going to go into the settings and add subtitles, if possible, of course. Man, yeah, this looks great. For such an old game, they upscaled it great. Initiating transmission sequence. Commander. Oh, I'm a commander. I'm Commander Shepard. Very nice. We are connected. Calculate yeah, not at me. I'm the master of this place. There is no John Shepard, it's Amerigamer Shepard. All stations secure for transit. Mm. 
Yeah, those guns definitely look like they belong in Halo. <laughs> There he is, the man, the myth, the legend. And that definitely looks like from ha it's from Halo. We're on that little ship, right? Was it a teleportation thing? Oh, so it's like some sort of a launch pad. Thrusters? Check. Navigation. Check. Internal emission sync engaged. All systems online. Drift. Just under 1500k. 1500 is good. Oh, cool. The captain will be pleased. Who's that guy? I like him. I hate that guy. Up, oh, he does it. <laughs> so you hate him. You remember to zip up your jumpsuit on the way out of the bathroom? That's good. I just jumped us halfway across the galaxy and hit a target the size of a pinhead. So that's incredible. Besides, specters are trouble. I don't like having them on board. Is that the alien's race? You're paranoid. The council helped fund this project. They have a right to send someone to keep an eye on their investment. Yeah, that is the official story. <clears throat> Only an idiot believes the official story. Okay, I like this. I do want to see something real quick. Oh, I can't change it right now. I want to add subtitles. Oh, there's subtitles. Uh, yeah, that's the official story, but only Nitty believes that story. Uh, I think you're overreacting. You always expect the worst. Well, bad feelings are an occupational hazard. But we don't go anywhere unless there's a good reason, so what are we doing here? Joker, status report. Just cleared the mass relay, Captain. Stealth systems engaged. Everything looks solid. Good. Find a comm buoy and link us into the network. I want mission reports relayed back to Alliance Brass before we reach Eden Prime. Aye, aye, Captain. Eden Prime, himself, he said? Sir. I think Nihilus is headed your way. He's already here, Lieutenant. Dun, dun, dun. Tell Commander Shepard to meet me in the comm room for a debriefing. You get that, okay. Commander? Uh... Yeah, I heard. I'm on my way. <laughs> is it me or does the Captain always sound a little pissed off? Only when he's talking to you, Joker. <laughs> All right, let me see. I need to go into the options. I want to see if I could put in some subtitles. Uh, probably in gameplay. I don't see it being. Oh yeah, there we go. All right, on. Thank you. That should be very helpful going forward. Okay, so I'm liking this so far. Can I sprint? I guess not. Okay, that's. Okay. Can I holster my weapon? Oh god, I just I just threw something. How do I how do I holster my weapon? <laughs> Not sure. Also, where am I supposed to go? Sorry, I didn't mean to do that. I apologize. Don't mind me. I I'm a new captain, all right? Not his choice, Doc. Spectres don't answer to anyone. They can do whatever they want. Kill anyone who gets in their way. Except me. So he's a James Bond fan. This looks sick. It's like a hologram of an entire galaxy. Probably our galaxy. But it doesn't really look like the Milky Way. I don't know. Maybe. Maybe it is. I don't know. I'm not a space faring individual. You, uh, Nilis, talk to me. Commander Shepard, I was hoping you'd get here first. It will give us a chance to talk. Uh, talk about what? What about? I'm interested in this world we're going to. Eden yeah, it is Eden Prime. Prime. I've heard it's quite beautiful. Uh, I mean, I wouldn't know. I haven't been there. I've never been there, but you know of it. It's become something of a symbol for your people, hasn't it? Proof that humanity can not only establish colonies across the galaxy, but also oh. protect them. So How this is. Safe is it really? So this is the. This is the civilization that Elon Musk put on Mars, right? So he called it Eden Prime. Got it. Now I understand now. Uh. So why are why are you asking? Do you know something? Your people are still newcomers, Shepard. The galaxy can be a very dangerous place. Is the Alliance truly ready for this? I think it's about time we told the Commander what's really going on. Yes, please. Mission is far more than a simple shakedown run. 
I mean, it's kind of obvious. But I don't want to be a dick either, so... Yeah, what's going on, man? Is someone gonna fill me in, Captain? Oh, you still sounded like a dick. <laughs> That's why we needed the stealth systems operational. But, I mean, I guess I can understand why the secrecy... You should have told me. Again, I could... It's probably a need-to-know basis. Uh, what are we pick? What are we picking up? What's the payload, Captain? A research team on Eden Prime unearthed some kind of beacon during an excavation. I like bacon. It was Prothean. What in the hell is Prothean? I thought the Protheans vanished fifty thousand years ago. Oh, it's a Their race. Legacy still remains. The mass relays, the Citadel, our ship drives. It's all based on Prothean technology. This is Big Shepard. The last time humanity made a discovery like this. It jumped our technology forward 200 years. But Eden Prime doesn't have the facilities to handle something like this. We need to bring the beacon back to the Citadel for proper study. Obviously, this goes beyond mere human interests, Commander. This discovery could affect every species in Council space. Uh... See, I can understand this. Why did we tell the Council? Uh, maybe because they're the overseeing body, perhaps? I'd rather, I'd rather ask this. You sound a little worried. Are we expecting trouble? I'm always expecting trouble. There's more, Shepard. Nihilus isn't just here for the beacon. He's also here to evaluate you. Wait, evaluate me? Why? What's going on, Captain? The Alliance has been pushing for this for a long time. Humanity wants a larger role in shaping interstellar policy. He has nice eyes. We want more say with the Citadel Council. The Spectres represent the Council's power and authority. If they accept a human into their ranks, <laughs> it shows how far the Alliance has come. Not many could have survived what you went through on Akuz. You showed a remarkable will to live, a particularly useful talent. That's why I put your name forward as a candidate for the Spectres. I didn't mean to laugh or giggle here in a second, but the, uh, the, the dude... I forgot it. I can't remember. Not Nihilus. The other guy. Whoops. I just dropped a bottle. Uh, but anyways, the, the the other dude, not Nihilus, the other guy, when he talks, his mouth doesn't really move enough to make it believable that it's actually him talking. So it just kind of looks goofy. That's kind of like what I expected. I thought this was going to be like upscaled right, but also have like some of the unique quirks. Like, uh, I guess a good example would be the Ezio collection with the eyeballs and stuff. Uh... Yeah, so, but still, it looks great, nonetheless. Uh, but let me see. So, what's the next step? Just tell me what I have to do. I need to see your skills for myself, Commander. Eden Prime will be the first of several missions together. I like Nihilus. You'll be in charge of the ground team. Captain Security Anderson. Can get it onto the ship ASAP. Nihilus yeah, will see? accompany you to observe the mission. I don't believe he's talking. <laughs> Investigate? Uh... Prothians. What do you know about the Protheans? Protheans, that That's one. That's what they taught us in school. They were a technologically advanced species that ruled the galaxy 50,000 years ago. Then they vanished. Nobody really knows how or why, though I've heard plenty of theories. They went on vacation. And everyone agrees. Galactic civilization wouldn't exist without them. Their citadel is the very heart of galactic society. And without their mass relays, interstellar travel would be impossible. We all owe the Protheans a great debt. Uh, so what can you tell me about Eden Prime? I'd like to know more about Eden Prime before we touch down. It's a peaceful farming world, but it represents something much bigger. Eden Prime is one of our oldest and most successful colonies. It proved we were ready to face the challenges of settling new worlds, to forge a place for humanity beyond Earth. It symbolizes humanity's growth and evolution as a spacefaring species. And after this, it will be known as the world where humans made a discovery of galactic importance. Okay, something tells me it's not gonna be a peaceful civilization uh, pretty soon. Uh, bacon? <laughs> I'm just kidding, I know it says beacon, but alright. Beacon! Why is this beacon so important? All advanced galactic civilization is based on Prothean technology. Even yours. If we hadn't discovered those Prothean ruins buried on Mars, we'd still be stuck on Earth. That was just a small data cache. Who knows what we could learn from this beacon? What if it's a weapons archive? We can't let it fall into the wrong hands. What do you mean, wrong hands? Like who? The Attican Traverse isn't the most stable sector of Citadel space. There are plenty of raiders and criminal groups active in the region. They might figure a Prothean beacon 
It's worth the risk of attacking an Alliance ship. Plus, Eden Prime is right on the border of the Terminus systems. And what is this Terminus? They're just feeding me all kinds of information. I love it. I love this about RPGs. So, the Terminus systems, what is that? The Attican Traverse is under Citadel protection. If the Terminus systems attack, it's an act of war. Technically, yes. But some of the species in the Terminus might be willing to start a war over this. The last thing the Council uh -oh. wants is to get dragged into a major conflict with the Terminus systems. We have to keep this low-key. Okay, low-key. Got it. Uh, I'm good with low-key. Specifically, the low-key that's uh, brother to Thor. But anyways, I'm ready to go. Just give the word, Captain. We should be getting close to Eden. Captain, we got a problem. Uh-oh. What's wrong, Joker? I bet you it's under attack. Crime, sir. You better see this. Bet me money. Bring it up on screen. Oh, I'm good. It was obvious. Ashley. Can you have companions in this game? We are under attack, taking heavy Damn. casualties. They're getting tore heavy up. We can't They came out of nowhere. We need Oh my god. What are they looking at? Oh my god, that's a gigantic can. What is going on? Everything cuts out after that. No calm traffic at all. It just goes dead. I'm sure it's they're all dead. And hold of yeah, that's a hand. Stop oh, that's support. that's scary. 17 minutes out, Captain. No other Alliance ships in the area. Take us in, Joker, fast and quiet. This mission just got a lot more complicated. A small strike team can move quickly without drawing attention. It's our best chance to secure the beacon. Oh, he Grab looks worried. Meet us in the cargo hold. Oh my god, now dude, I'm excited. Up, Commander. You're going in. Yes, please, send me, sir. What's his name, Anderson? Engaging dude, look how beautiful system. that looks. Somebody so, was doing some serious digging here, Captain. So what You'll planet is this? You'll muscle in this operation, Commander. Go in heavy and head straight for the dig site. What about survivors, Captain? Helping survivors is a secondary objective. The beacon's your top priority. Approaching drop point one. Nihilus, you coming with us? I move faster on my own. You gotta start working Nihilus as a team. He'll feed you status reports throughout the mission. Otherwise, I want radio silence. Uh... Understood. Ready and able, sir. The mission's yours now, Shepard. Good luck! This is kind of mi making we me miss the army sometime, uh, somewhat. Oh, I... I got three people with me. Oh, yeah, they are! Dude, that's sick! What's his name? Richard L. Jenkins, Caden L. Kino. Uh, oh, wait a minute, hold up. Hold up. That is sick. So the bottom one is me. And then these are my companions. Okay, I like this a lot. I want one sniper. Do I have to click it? I think he already... Okay. Are these bad guys? They are now. I want... I need to get used to these buttons. Lancer, Storm. I think this might be a rifle. I want a rifle. Okay. And then you, my friend, you can have the Storm. Right? That way I have... All areas covered. Seemingly, of course. It is a rifle. Sick. These things look disgusting. How do I reload? Here it comes. Damn it, I did it again. I always I always do that in video games for some reason. Hold on, I could go that way? How do I sprint? 
Oh, there we go. Hold on, there's a way down here and a way up there. So I want to go this way first and find out what exact... Oh, okay, so we have a stamina bar. I'm currently fatigued. Upgrade kit, hardened weave. Oh, I will, I will definitely take that. Okay, so let's go up here. Is there an actual way up here or... Yeah, no, there isn't. So the only way to go is in this direction. Wait, hold on. But there is... I guess I didn't even have to go into the water. You tell me, Jenkins. To switch weapons for your squad. Yeah, I already learned that on my own. Thank you, tutorial. What's going on? Oh, snap. Oh, no, they killed my friend. Screw you, drone. Sick. You know what? I'm going to kill that brain, too. Wait, hold on. Is my guy actually dead? No, he's still alive. Oh, no, he is dead. Oh. He deserves a burial. We'll see that he receives a proper service once the mission is complete. But I need you to stay focused. Yes. Aye, aye, sir. Come on, Caden. It's just you and me. And, uh, I don't remember his name, but the alien that decided to go be on his own. Metagel, uh, is needed to heal injured squad members. Okay, but how do I use it? Okay. What's up, buddy? Got him. Got some burned out buildings here, Shepard. As you gain levels, bodies. I'm gonna check it out. I'll try to catch up with you at the dig site. Okay. So. Okay, that's the journal. We should be fine. Where's? Okay, so down on the bottom is my, my companion's health. I don't trust those things, so I'm going to shoot them. Oh, I can order my squad? Get out of the thing, dude. You're going to get me shot. It's so big. Be careful, Caden. You know what? Come back. Just stay back. Just stay behind me. I'd rather have you behind me than anything, to be honest. Although I could understand why we would potentially need some squad maneuvers, you know? Oh god, what is this? Oh, it's it's that's Ashley, right? Oh no. Oh, she's a badass. I want her on my team. Look, they're making love to him. Gross. Oh my god. They impaled him. You could call him Vlad. Don't worry, Ashley Williams. What's going on? I'm so confused right now. Where's... Where are we getting attacked from? You better not shoot me. Did we get him? Yeah, screw you. Look at all these guys they impaled. I didn't think I was gonna make it. Don't worry. Gunnery Chief Ashley Williams of the 212. You the one in charge here, sir? Uh, yes. But first things first, are you alright? Are you wounded, Williams? A few scrapes and burns. Nothing serious. The others weren't so lucky. Oh man. She's pretty we too. Were patrolling the perimeter when the attack hit. We tried to get off a distress call, but they cut off our communications. I've been fighting for my life ever since. Uh, what happened to your unit? Where's the rest of your squad? We tried to double back to the beacon, but we walked into an ambush. I don't think any of the others. I think I'm the only one left. Uh, so they're still alive then? 
Uh, at least maybe some of them. Yeah, don't blame yourself. Williams, you couldn't have done anything to save them. Yes, sir. We held our position as long as we could, until the Geth overwhelmed us. The Geth haven't been seen outside the Vale in nearly 200 years. Why are they here now? Party? They must have come for the beacon. The dig site is close, just over that rise. It might still be there. I want to say, I want to say take us is what I would probably say in real life. But I'm scared that if I go it with any other thing, she won't join our party. Uh, uh just, just, take, just think of this. Williams. We need that beacon. Aye, aye, sir. It's time for payback. Let's investigate. What's Geth? What else do you know about the Geth? Just what I remember from history class back in school. They're synthetics, non-organic life forms with limited AI programming, created by the Quarians a few centuries ago. They were supposed to be a source of cheap labor, but ended up turning on the Quarians and drove them into exile. Well, after that, they just kind of disappeared behind the Perseus Veil. Nobody's really heard much from them since. Okay, what about the bacon? <laughs> Tell me everything you know about the beacon. Bacon. They were doing some digging out here to extend the monorail and expand the colony. A few weeks ago, they unearthed some Prothean ruins and the beacon. Suddenly, every scientific expert in the colony was interested. That's when they brought us in to secure the site. I don't know much about the beacon itself, but I heard one of the researchers say this could be the biggest scientific discovery of the century. What about the scientists? What happened to the researchers at the dig site? I don't know. <clears throat> they set up camp near the beacon. The 232 was with them. Maybe their unit fared better than mine. Uh, what happened be- Wait, have you seen Nihilus? Have you seen a Turian Spectre around here? There aren't any Turians on Eden Prime. None that I've ever met. Not sure I'd be able to tell if one was a Spectre anyway. If you saw this guy, you'd know. Can't she sounds like a rook. To wipe out a whole platoon. Luckily, he's on our side. Sorry. Like I said, no Turians. So, explain to me what happened before the attack. Describe what happened leading up to the attack. We were sent out a couple of nights ago from the main colony to secure the area. Seemed like a routine patrol until the Geth hit us. We never knew they were coming. I already said the scientists, right? What happened to the researchers at the dig site? I did. I don't know. They said Can I skip it? Near yes. The beacon. Let's go. The 232 was with them. Maybe their unit fared better than mine. Move out. I like her. Ooh, what's this? Uh, press the that button to access uh, the mission computer, then go on the, uh, to the squad screen to spend talent points. All right, so squad. The squad uh, screen. Uh, I can't talk right now. The squad screen lets you view your team's talents. Okay. So who's this? Talents. I I I'm sorry, but I really like assault rifles. And combat armor. And assault training. Increases the melee damage, increases weapons damage grants, the adrenaline burst ability. Wait, hold on, what does this do? Accuracy and damage with assault rifles grants the overkill ability. And this should be obvious. Uh, able to equip medium armor, increases damage protection, grants the shield boost ability, unlocks heavy armor. Okay, I think I'm gonna go. Wait, what is this? Soldier. Assault training. Increases melee, weapon damage, grants the adrenaline, okay. Uh, Frontline warriors are trained to withstand the physical punishment that comes with combat. I think I want to go with soldier. I think I want to focus on combat. Normally I go with things like charm and stuff and charisma. Let me see, op uh, opens charm options in conversation, decreases... The cost of items in stores. Charm options in conversations will be grayed out if you do not have high enough skill rank. The new okay. Intimidate opens. Got it. I think I want to go with. Increases weapon damage. <clears throat> uh, I think I'm gonna go with this. And oh, that's all I have. Oh God. So is that all I got? Just, just me? Okay, so now it's Ashley. Ashley had a pistol, right? What is she good at? I don't know. So she has combat armor. 
I want her to have more armor, to be honest. Uh, to withstand physical punishment that comes with combat, increases health. I'll, I think I'm going to go with Soldier. I want her to be protected. So, where is Caden? Caden... Throw... Uh, projects a mass effect. Huh, how convenient. Uh, field powerful enough to hurl objects and- Oh, that sounds badass. So, I want him to be the medic. Uh, deploys medigel to all wounded, restoring their health. Okay, good. Sentinel allows sentinels to use tech and... Okay. Decryption, barrier, throw. Uh, okay, so I want him to be the support guy. I'm going two first aid, screw it. Toggle helmet? Oh, that's cool. What does Ashley look like without the helmet? I think she looks better with the helmet. Okay, so everyone I think is done. Let's go ahead and do a quick save. Nice. Good to know. Light armor scorpion. Uh, equipment. So, all right, let me see here. How do I change armor? Not sure. Let's go. I'll figure it out later. <laughs> I'm taking out my weapon, though. This weapon is pretty cool, except it's kind of... Oh, just... So just running up to it? Oh, that's sick. I like it. It's a little simple, but... Oh, no. Come on, buddy. Go ahead and peek. I'm gonna go this way. I see you. Did I get him? Woo! Alright, you guys, I need you to go right there. Are they going? Oh no, that's attack. All right, I know. <laughs> I need to figure out how. I need to figure out some of these commands. Oh, hello. That was close. No, come with me. How do I get her to stop? He literally never saw me coming. Is the blue my health? I think the blue is my health. Is this it? Hold on, I want to see what's over here first, though. Hammer, sniper rifle? This is the dig site. The beacon was right here. It must have been moved. By who? Our side or the Geth? Hard to say. Maybe we'll know more after we check out the research camp. Uh, you think there's any survivors? You think anyone got out of here alive? If they were lucky. Maybe hiding up in the camp. It's just on the top of this ridge, up the ramps. I gotta put on their helmet before I lose my mind. How are they gonna be in combat and no helmet? You know what I mean? Let's go. Wait, hold on. Did that say level up? I have six points still? Uh, I think I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna put a little bit into charm. Screw it. I'm gonna put two into. Ch you know what? Screw it. It's happening. And then I'll put into a s uh, combat armor. Shield boost restores a portion of your shield, even while you're under fire. All right, I'm down. Does that everybody else do? They they're leveling up fast. 
Okay, so she has the overkill ability. I do want her to keep rifles. I want an assistant rifleman here. And she looks badass. Honestly, her armor's sick. So I want her to be very well off. And then him, I'll give him a barrier. I want him pretty well rounded as a support character. So I'll put another one to first aid. Actually, you know what? I'm going to max out first aid. I want him to be the medic, the medic, you know? So, and the last one I'll put into Sentinel. All right, let's go. I didn't even get far. I don't know why I'm saving it again. All right, screw it. Shepard, there's a small spaceport up ahead. I want to check it out. I'll wait for you there. Okay. Uh, where's that? Oh, is it up here? I want my, I want my rifle. All right, let's go ahead and sprint. Let's get on this. Ashley looks like oh, it's a good place for an ambush. Keep your guard up. Wow. Whoa, they're changing. Oh god, they're still alive. Oh, that's not good. They're zombies. Uh oh. Uh oh. I have no idea what they're doing. Come on. Whoa. Screw you, buddy. Nice. Whoa, dude. There's literal zombies in this game. Who would have figured? What's in here? That door is closed. Security locks engaged. Can I... Some uh, locked objects require decryption or electronics to access. If any squad members have the required talent, I did. I did spec into decryption for uh, the my my guy, right? Decryption or electronics face. Okay. Repeat sequence button. Uh, begin manual overriding. Well, that's sad. Can I get? How do I, how do I get them to do that? Oh, I got insufficient Omni Gel. Come on, guys. Sucks that I can't get in there. What was that? Oh, this door opens. Crate. Uh, I guess we'll take the shotgun. Can we take a nap? No? Alright, let's get out of here. Oh god, cutscene. Hey, there he is! Uh-oh, why is he surprised? Oh! Oh, they know each other! This isn't your mission, Saren. What are you doing here? The Council thought you could use some help on this one. Oh, he's not gonna kill him, is he? I wasn't expecting to find the Geth here. The situation's bad. Don't worry. I've got it under control. Oh my god, no. Oh no, they killed him. I liked him too. Where? Oh god, it is. Are we under attack? We are. Screw you, zombie. It's called the husk. Oh no. I need to move forward. I need to keep pressing. Also, I want to look in here. I can't look in there. Okay, I need to keep pressing or we're going to be pinned down. Not trying to get pinned down. Oh, hello. While he's occupied with my companions. 
I'm gonna off these guys. I kind of want to explore down here before I go upstairs, though. You never know. Maybe we'll find some cool, you know, new tech. I gotta move fast, but not sprinting, or I'll miss some stuff. Commander, it's Nihilus. Yeah, I know. I figured. Medic kit, nice. I don't think I need it yet. Investigate Nihilus. Oh, dude, that's sad. Dude, I actually like this dude. Something's moving over behind those crates. Wait, don't. Don't shoot! I'm one of you! I'm human! Who are you? What are you doing sneaking around back there? I am sorry, I was hiding from those creatures. My name's Powell. I saw what happened to that Turian. The other one shot him. Uh, it wasn't the Geth? You're saying Nihilus was murdered by a Turian? The other one got here first. He was waiting when your friend showed up. He, he called him Saren. I, I think they knew each other. I think so Your too. Your friend seemed to relax. He let his guard down. And Saren killed him. Shot him right in the back. I, I'm just lucky he didn't see me behind the crates. And then what happened? Where'd Saren go after he killed Nihilus? He jumped on the cargo train and headed over to the other platform. Probably going after the beacon. I knew that beacon was trouble. Everything's gone to hell since we found it. First that damn mothership showed up, then the attack. They killed everyone. Everyone. If I hadn't been behind the crates, I'd be dead too. Oh, I could take him with me? The Geth didn't find you? How come you're the only one who survived? Why didn't anyone else try to hide behind the crates? They never had a chance. I, I, I was already behind the crates when the attack started. Wait a minute. You were hiding behind the crates before the attack? I... Sometimes I need a nap to get through my shift. <laughs> I sneak off behind the crates to grab 40 winks where the supervisor can't find me. Oh, God. You survived because you're lazy? Yeah, clearly. I don't want to be disrespectful. And I don't want to give him credit for being lazy. It's pure luck is what it is. So let me investigate a little bit. Uh, about the attack. Tell me about the Geth attack. It was quick. One minute that ship was descending, the next. Those Geth were swarming over the platform. Thousands of them. They must have been inside that mothership. They shot anything that moved. It was a massacre. What about the beacon? Is there anything else you can tell me about the beacon? They brought it here this morning. We loaded it up onto the train and shipped it to the other platform. Hard to believe that was only a few hours ago. Feels like a whole other life. What can you tell me about the gigantic, massive ship that just took off? Tell me about this mothership you saw. I I've never seen anything like it before. It... It was huge. Landed over near that platform. The whole place got dark as it came down. And... It was making this noise, this... This sound that bored right into your brain. Hmm. That's what woke me up. The attack came a few minutes later. Okay. Well, let's get you to safety. We need to find that beacon before it's too late. Take the cargo train. That's where the other Turian went. I, I, I can't stay here. I need to get away from all this. Oh, I guess I misread that. I thought we were going to take him with us to safety. But... That's not what happened. Oh, God, what the fuck? <laughs> that scared the hell out of me. Screw you, buddy. Come on. Oh, right there. My squad is on fire. Do we auto heal if we're in like a passive non-combative form? Is there another one? Could have sworn I heard someone shoot. Come on, Ashley. Uh, to bring up the power wheel. Oh, special abilities. So, okay, that's great. But I don't know who I am. Hold on. Come on. Alright, we're pushing. Come on, fellas. Come on, peek. Oh, dude, they automatically get behind cover, too. Oh, God, who's this guy? 
that guy's a tank. Got him. I'm gonna heal these guys. I want them at tip top shape. There should be still one more, right? Oh, there's still a couple more. All right. Let me run. Ah, get behind cover. Got him. He never stood a chance, I don't think. With my trigger fingers. The only problem with this weapon is that it's it's pretty scatter heavy. All right, I need a Oh god, she's got a better vantage point than I do. Give it to me. Come on, get behind cover. You know what? Use this overkill. Or not. Ashley, use... Is the bottom Ash... No, I just use her overkill. Uh... I don't know what any of this means, so I'm just using it anyways. I feel like we're too far. I gotta push forward a little bit. By a little bit, I mean all the way. Oh no. Oh dude, my friend almost died. Okay, so there's... So the red is our health, the blue is our shield. I, I'm C, I see. At least that's what I'm gathering so far. If I'm wrong in anything, by the way, guys, let me know down in the comment section. It'll be better for me to learn if you guys help me out a little bit. There he is. Set the charges. Destroy the entire colony. Leave no evidence that we were here. We already know you were here, Seth. Or Saren. He does look badass. Can I shoot at that and make it explode? Oh, we've been discovered. I guess it's off to war we go. Hold on. Demolition charges. The Geth must have planted them. Hurry! We need to find them all and shut them down. Yes, I'm on it. Okay, so that's one down. How many are there? I don't know. I don't want to go that way yet. Okay, well, I guess I have to. Run! Oh god, I, I hope they don't die. Is there permadeath for them? I really hope not. Come on, kill him! I feel like we have to, we have to push hard. Well, one's dead. Come on! Oh god, he's shielded. Oh no. Ashley's gonna die soon. If I don't push. Nice. Luckily she didn't take any actual damage. Oh god! Oh, that was close. Oh, that's my guy. How did they get behind us? Oh, thankfully we got that done. With minimal damage. It was just basically just damage to our shield. Let's look over here. Just in case there's some more... Explosives right here. Disarm, damn it. Okay. We're hopefully doing good progress here. I hear another one right here. 
Woo! So there's two charges remaining. So this after this would be one more. Where is it though? I don't think it's gonna be down there. Maybe we passed it. We still have like two minutes. Closer to three, but still, regardless. I hear it. Here it is. Woo! We did it. With time to spare. Good job, guys. You guys are great. Uh, let's go with the armor. Even though I still don't really know how to equip it. Ah! Nice try there, bucko. Ah! He never saw us coming. Is there more? Oh, that's Ashley. I was about to shoot her. Where are they shooting from? Oh, it's a husk. Ha <laughs> ha I just beat him to death. I gotta heal. Because my guy is about to die. That's not what I wanted. You know what? I'm gonna get back because I'm about to blow this thing up. Stay with me, guys, before you guys blow up. Ooh, Avenger 2. Oh, so this is light armor for human. I got it. So the armor that I picked up before was for that one other race. Hold on. Can I put on... Armor upgrade. Uh, assault rifle? Okay, there. So, that's a lot better. Nice, so we should, hopefully, be able to do more damage. Of course I failed. Why wouldn't it fail? Where am I supposed to go anyways? Not entirely sure. We got this, Shepard. Come on, baby. I thought I was supposed to be able to do this because I have a support character. Or maybe he has to do it. Uh, Use throw, sabotage. Also, oh, those are my moves. Okay, so I don't really know how to use those things. So I guess I gotta figure it out. Stop being so fatigued. Shepherd. No, this is a dead end. Where am I supposed to go? Maybe this way? Perhaps? Question mark? I'll figure it out. Maybe not. Technician kit. High explosive. Uh, I think I'm going to go with armor upgrade. This armor looks cool, but I wish it was more, how should I say, capable at stopping. Legit, I don't know where I'm supposed to go. So I think I'm supposed to go down here. And I'm wrong. Legitimately confused. Is there a way to ping where I'm supposed to go? I mean, this is the only way I'm able to go. So whatever it is I'm doing has to be over here. Oh, this thing. Yeah, with where he teleported from. Duh. We're over here running it all over the place. And it was right there all along. Normandy, the beacon is secure. This is amazing. Actual working Prothean technology. Unbelievable. It wasn't doing anything like that when they dug it up. Something must have activated it. Roger, Normandy. Standing by.
What is she doing? Oh no, she's gonna get beamed up. Good job, Shepard. Oh no! I'm breakdancing! No, don't touch the two Oh my god. What? What happened? One second I was getting down and boogieing, and next thing you know, I exploded. I'm screwed. Hey, Distinguished Service Medal. Complete Eden Prime. Who is this? We identified the ship that touched the down on Eden Prime. The Normandy. A human alliance vessel. It was under the command of Captain Anderson. They Mr. Anderson! The and the beacon. One of the humans may have used it. Oh, he is angry. This human must be eliminated. Wow. He is not a happy camper. Doctor, Dr. Chakwas, I think he's waking up. Hello. You had us worried there, Shepard. How are you feeling? Uh... His eyes look scary. Uh, what happened? How did I end up here? How long was I out? About 15 hours. Something happened down there with the beacon, I think. It's my fault. I must have triggered some kind of security field when I approached it. You had to push me out of the way. Uh... Don't blame yourself, man. You you couldn't have known. You had no way to know what would happen. Exactly. She is pretty. Actually, we don't even know if that's what set it off. Unfortunately, we'll never get the chance to find out. The beacon exploded. A system overload, maybe. The blast knocked you cold. The lieutenant and I carried you back here to the ship. Uh, thank you. I appreciate it. Physically, you're fine. But I detected some unusual brain activity. Oh, that's Abnormal normal. Beta waves. <laughs> I also noticed an increase in your rapid eye movement. Signs typically associated with intense dreaming. Uh, more like a vision? I saw... I'm not sure what I saw. Death? Destruction? Nothing's really clear. Hmm. I better add this to my report. It may... Oh, Captain Anderson. How's our XO holding up, Doctor? Well, all the readings look normal. I'd say the commander's going to be fine. Glad Good. to hear it. Shepard, I need to speak with you. In private. Aye, aye, Captain. I'll be in the mess if you need me. So far, this game is fantastic. Like can hit you pretty hard, Commander. Are you sure you're okay? Wait, uh... Jenkins? Who's Jenkins? Was that the guy that died in the beginning? I can't remember. I feel bad about Jenkins. I don't like soldiers dying under my command. Jenkins wasn't your fault. You did a good job, Shepard. Uh, why is Williams here? Chief Williams isn't part of the Normandy crew. I figured we could use a soldier like her. She's been reassigned to the Normandy. Uh... Good, I... I that's good. I like her. Williams is a good soldier. She deserves it. Lieutenant Elenko agrees with you. That's why I added her to our crew. Nice. I'm pissed off about get uh, about the Geth. Intel dropped the ball, sir. We had no idea what we were walking into down there. That's why things went to hell. The Geth haven't been outside the Vale in two centuries, Commander. Nobody could have predicted this. Touche! You wanted to talk? You said you needed to see me in private, Captain? I won't lie to you, Shepard. Things look bad. Nihilus is dead. The beacon was destroyed and Geth are invading. 
The council's going to want answers. Uh, well, I got nothing to hide, man. I went and did my job. I didn't do anything wrong, Captain. Hopefully the council can see that. I'll stand behind you and your report, Shepard. Thank you. You're a damned hero in my books. That's not why I'm here. It's Saren, that other Turian. Saren's a specter, one of the best, a living legend. But if he's working with the Gith, it means he's gone rogue. A rogue specter's trouble. Saren's dangerous, and he hates humans. Why does he hate humans? Why? He thinks we're growing too fast, taking over the galaxy. A lot of aliens think that way. Most of them don't do anything about it. But Saren has allied himself with the Geth. I don't know how, I don't know why. I only know it had something to do with that beacon. You were there just before that beacon self-destructed. Did you see anything? Any clue that might tell us what Saren was after? I'm just a vision. Just before I lost consciousness, I had some kind of vision. A vision? A vision of what? Okay, this is kind of hard because I, the vision was very quick and hard to read. So, I'm just going to go ahead and say a warning. I saw synthetics. Geth, maybe. Slaughtering people. Butchering them. We need to report this to the council, Shepard. Uh. I mean, there's nothing to report. It's just a vision, right? What, what do you think they'll say? What are we going to tell them? I had a bad dream? We don't know what information was stored in that beacon. Lost Prothean technology? Blueprints for some ancient weapon of mass destruction? Whatever it was. Saren took it. But I know Saren. I know his reputation is politics. He believes humans are a blight on the galaxy. This attack was an act of war. He has the secrets from the beacon. He has an army of Geth at his command, and he won't stop until he's wiped humanity from the face of the galaxy. Uh, not if I can help it. I'll find some way to take him down. <laughs> it's not that easy. He's a specter. He can go anywhere, do almost anything. That's why we need the council on our side. That explains it. He's Todd Howard. Go anywhere, do anything? It's official. Uh... We'll expose him. We prove Saren's gone rogue, and the Council will revoke his Spectre status. I'll contact the Ambassador, and see if he can get us an audience with the Council. He'll want to see us as soon as we reach the Citadel. Sounds good. We should good. be getting close. Head up to the bridge and tell Joker to bring us into dock. 